Two one ball game. Miami on top of New York. It's the fourth. Let's check in with Craig Minervini. Craig. Rich, one of our favorite Marlins. I, I can't even believe it's been that, that many years because you look like you're ready to go out and play first base. Mike Jacobs is now going to be a manager in the system first. How are you? And good to see you and your clan here. Four children. Yeah, four little girls. So I'm doing well. It's good to see you guys. Uh, first time here at the park and um, we have an off day tomorrow down there in extended spring training and yeah. I uh, thought I'd bring the family down here and uh, check out this new park. So. I bet you would have loved to play inside uh, beautiful Marlins Park, huh? Yeah, it was funny. Angela was giving us a, a walk around on the field earlier, and uh, you, we were not immediately sweating uh, <laughs> as we stepped on the field. So um, it's beautiful in here. It's, uh, it's, it's fun to be back, obviously, and, uh, you know, a lot of familiar faces just walking around the ballpark, seeing people, and, um, you know, just excited to be here tonight. Both teams, too, with the Mets, who, where you played also in, in their organization, how fondly do you think of that infield the amazing historic infield they all hit over 25 homers nearly 30 with uh, Cantu coming up one short Hanley Ugla and obviously you over at first base you know it was it was a really fun year some special and um, some I'll never forget obviously and um, you know just great group of guys we had that year um, you know still talk to some of them was actually playing with Cantu last year um, down in uh, in Mexico and um, he's still playing again this year and uh, you know it's just uh, Definitely think about that team a lot. Think yeah. about that year. Um, you had a lot of fun in South Florida playing for the Marlins. Yeah, we did. We did have a lot of fun. We 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 we, we, were, we were good boys, but but we had a lot of fun, and it was uh, you know it, it was definitely something I missed. This that was a good baseball experience. All right, so you made the managerial move. Decided to at least hang up the cleats from a playing standpoint. You're going to manage the Batavia Muck Dogs in the New York Pen. That's the short season league. Uh, and you looking forward to that? I am. I am. It's a uh, you know it's, it's an incredible opportunity to have straight out of uh, out of from obviously getting out of playing last year and jump straight into the to a manager's role. It's something that I've been thinking about over the last few years, and um, you know obviously this opportunity came up and and I couldn't say no to it. And uh, just obviously to be able to put back on a Marlins uniform for one, yeah. and then two just to be able to, uh, to to be able to step into a manager's role like that. Um, I think it's huge and I, I'm looking forward to it. You bring so much experience and you also probably can tell them how quick it can it goes when you're in the majors and you're playing baseball. Is that w among the messages you'll tell because it's a young group you're going to have of talented players. Yeah it is. They, they are a young group and you know one of the biggest things I think that, that you try to do to them is not only you're trying to teach them how to play baseball you're trying to teach them how to be a man as well and um, you know kind of show them show them what it's about to to uh, step into pro ball and what what, what that is and, and how to prepare themselves um, obviously besides just the fundamentals of the game you know you're trying to protect, teach them how to prepare themselves for for every day the grind in and out of it so um, you know so far it's been great we've got a great group of guys down there in, in Jupiter and um, they're working their tails off the staff down there is working really hard and um, it's been a pleasure so far Jake one last thing do you have a favorite memory when you think of your Marlin days uh, gosh something that stands out you know what it uh, it's obviously got to be 08 it, it's, it's obviously that that infield and and uh, you know what we were able to do that year um, just with with you know nobody else in, in baseball ever having done that and, um, I think that was pretty special it's, it's definitely something that I'll, I'll never forget you ever tease Cantu for hitting the top of the car uh, in San Francisco all the time make fun of, well I make fun of him all the time for coming up one homer short of the of the 30 that's right uh, you hit the top of that car yeah, uh -huh, in San right. Francisco. Francisco that's right yep yeah you're right um, you know it, it, was, it was great and um, you know, I'm just, like I said, happy to be back in the Marlins. Uh, we're Park. happy to have you back. Good to talk. And what a great interview is going to be for all the media as well. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> all right, Perfect. Mike, Thank thanks you. a lot. Appreciate White Valerie here and the whole family. And isn't that a good looking bunch, huh?